All right, most bosses are, are just awesome people. They're incredible. They're, they're the boss for a reason. Uh, maybe they own the company, uh, but whatever it is, they, mo most of the time, they are just incredible people, and they're there for a reason. So, uh, but imagine that that's true. You have a boss, but then there's another boss that, that wants to, like, take over. And, and, and says, no, 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 they're not the boss, I'm the boss. And, and, and that one ain't so good. That, that one has no business running things. Uh, they don't have the skills, they don't have the resources to do all that, but they're, they are demanding that you serve them, they're demanding that you listen to them and not listen to the other. Um, whoever is truly your boss, I, I think in life, like when you're at work or you're at school or whatever, there's, man, you can only listen to one at a time. Uh, because when you have, you have two, and this is what Jesus is talking about today, where there's, there's two like messages, man, and they're conflicting. One has all the goods, the other one doesn't. One's adding to your life, one's taking away, but they're both going, hey, listen to me, you better obey me, uh, right? Jesus says in Matthew 6, 24, and this, 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 hit, this hits our priorities. It hits like what life is all about. Uh, Matthew 6, 24, Jesus says that, that you can't serve two masters. It doesn't work that way. For either you're going to hate the one and love the other or be devoted to the one and despise the other. Because once you're, because it's, it's your boss. It's, it's your master. It's, it's the one who controls things, and, and, and I think in that context, it was the one who gave you all that you needed and, and provided for you and your life. And he said, you can't serve God in money. He's, he's bringing up that, that issue. Um, money often wants us to, to do that. Now, we would say that, that, that no one wants to admit that they would, they would make money their master, that, that it would rule us, but it does sometimes. How, how many times do we choose to cheat or to, or to be dishonest, um, you know, when the right thing, the God thing to do, what God wanted us to do was to, to, to maybe, uh, maybe not have as many followers on our social media, maybe not to make as much money, but we're going to do the right thing. Because uh, we're not going to cut corners and we're going to do right by people. Maybe we're going to spend a little more time with everybody um, in our lives. Uh, yeah, and we're not going to be as popular and, and, and all those things. Do you see how it works? And, and money or any other thing that's, that's driving that is, is not going to love people the way we're supposed to. It's not going to do life the way we're going to supposed to. And he's saying, look, you can't serve both. Money is going to take you in a, in, a, in a totally different direction, one that's centered on, on it, on making more of it, of having more of it, and, and on honestly taking from other people as well. Whereas, whereas God, serving God, He is giving, 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 giving always to us, always filling us and, 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 uh, and making just incredible things happen in our lives. So we serve Him. Today, I want us to do to say, you know what, Lord, I'm, I'm, let's confess where I have made other things, especially money, my master. I, I've let it guide me. I've let it lead me around uh, to places that maybe you didn't want me to go. Lord, and I am sorry. Please forgive me. I, I, I want you to be my priority, my Lord, my everything, because you have given me everything and you continue to give me everything, even your son. Right? You didn't even spare him, but you gave him for me that I might have life, that I might have hope. That's the kind of master we serve. That's the kind of one that, that has us in his hands every single day. Let that comfort you. Let that guide you. Um, and let that change you uh, for his glory. All right? We'll talk to you next time. Hit that subscribe button. Share this with somebody already. That would be an awesome thing. Um, we, was, we want to see lives change, and, and that's how it works. So let's get that word out. Talk to you next time.